All right, what's going on, everyone? My name is Mr. Boss for the Win, as you guys already know that, and this is going to be another episode of some Black Ops 2 news and insights. So on my last few videos, a lot of people were complaining uh, that the quality was a little lower. I know that those were videos that I grabbed uh, either from a long time ago or from like a theater mode or something like that. So yes, the quality was not as good. But if you're watching this video, this video is uh, this is like my normal 720p HD video. Uh, you remember on the YouTube thing, you have to click the 720p button in order to see 720p. Anyways, we're going to be talking about the crossbow. The very first picture should be coming up right now. So it is confirmed that Black Ops 2 is going to be having a crossbow, which is interesting because in Gamescom 2012, there was no build of Black Ops 2 with a crossbow in it. Uh, so as you can see right now, the crossbow does have an ACOG sight on it, which is really different. Um, and you, another thing you might have noticed is it has six rounds instead of the typical three. Now he was using, I think, Scavenger, which might have given him uh, more ammunition, which would make sense. Uh, so it looks like the, the crossbow is going to have some similar attachments of its own. As you know, it, it already comes standard with the uh, explosive bolt because the crossbow uh, bolt on its own does not do enough damage to kill. Uh, so I'm assuming that the ACOG site won't will only take up one of your attachments, which is cool because uh, I know sometimes I had trouble when I did use the crossbow using it. It w wouldn't work all the time because I had really horrible accuracy. Uh, so let's read what uh, they have to say. So a leaked Black Ops 2 multiplayer gameplay, gameplay video was posted on YouTube yesterday which shows the Black Ops 2 crossbow in action. It appears to have a newer design compared to the Black Ops version. And some people are saying this is hacked. I'm not sure. We're still working. Uh, they say they're still working out, um, you know, the, the information on the video. But if it does tell you anything, Activision removed the video. And when Activision typically removes something, it basically means that it, it has some legitimacy or it does have some realism based into the game. So if you look at those two pictures right there, you can go back and slow them down if you want. The crossbow looks a lot more fierce in this game than it did in the original Black Ops. And Black Ops, it kind of looked like a toy. Look at that, plus 900. Are you serious? That's like multi-kill times 1,000. That's a Nuketown chopper gunner right there for you. But basically, uh, what I was going to say is this crossbow looks a lot more fierce and a lot more intimidating. So I was going to say the, the crossbow in Black Ops kind of looked like a toy almost. Um, it was kind of like, oh, let me shoot this little bolt at you and uh, hope I hit you. So this one looks a lot more fierce. I'm gonna, it's going to be interesting to see uh, if they did buff the uh, explosive radius that applies to the crossbow because I don't know if the crossbow was uh, similar to a noob tube. I think it was a little less than a noob tube. Like It, it didn't do the same amount of splash damage, um, especially because it had to hit someone to kill. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see what they do, if they do any tweaks to it, do they make the reload any faster, because that was the one downside of the crossbow. If you did not have sleight of hand, uh, you were essentially stuck uh, praying and hoping that you would have enough time to reload. Anyways guys, my name has been Mr. Boss with the Win. Uh, I hope you like the video and subscribe if you are new. Anyways, I will see you in the next episode and uh, have a nice day. Alright guys, two videos you might have missed. My last video, which actually went up yesterday evening, was a, uh, a funny video where a grenade landed on my head. It, it was pretty funny, so I encourage you to check that out. And then my last Black Ops 2 video talked about multiplayer details um, that David Vonderhart actually did a question and answer. So check those two videos out, click them out right now, and um, have a nice day, guys.